Ladies and gentlemen, the day is upon us. Multiversus is coming back. This, I mean, I'm just, I'm so excited. We waited a year for this, okay? A year for some kind of update, some kind of information, and we finally got it. You know, this channel started with Multiverses, so it is a game I hold dear to my heart. So let's just go ahead and take a look at this. I mean, there's not much else to say other than let's just, you know, look at it. Player first. Oh, there's the man, the myth, the legend, Tony. <laughs> All right. I'm Tony, game director of Multiverses and co-founder of Player First Games. I'm excited to share that our free-to-play platform fighter, Multiverses, mm -hmm. is launching on May 28th. May 28th. Okay, that's a bit further out than I thought. But May 28th. We've been hard at work. I'd like to give you a sneak peek of what we've been up to. They really just jumped right into it, too. They just said, hey. We set out to make a game that not only packs a punch, but makes a mark on the game genre we love. All right. It's always been our aspiration. No new characters yet. That you'll love as much as we do. We've been working hard on a variety of changes and updates to deliver an improved gameplay experience. So let's get into it. All right, let's get into it. What we got? Multiverses is our wealth of iconic characters in the game. With fun filled competition set against the backdrop. All right. Imagine universes and environments. And Giant, Steven, Rick, so Stripe, we'll or Morty and Stripe. Really exciting, brand new personalities to the roster. All right, like who? Four stages from worlds we have yet to explore. All right, new concept arts. Okay. We moved to Unreal Engine 5. And they upgraded the engine. Okay. So in other words, shaggy sandwiches have never looked better. The upgrade to Unreal 5 is interesting. But Unreal is a good engine, so. To support our new net code, to provide consistent world -class Ooh, and new netcode. It seems like there was a lot of behind-the-scenes stuff going on. Will be delivered with pinpoint accuracy. There'll be consistent game performance. Which is important. No matter what platform you're playing on. There'll be new attacks and common mechanics. Oh, yep. New move for Morty. New move for Taz. To see what you come up with. The balance of power is restored. One of the things we're most excited to announce is a brand new PvE mode that will offer a new way to play outside of competitive PvP. This new mode will introduce additional ways of playing with unique rewards. All right, Game of Thrones stage. I'm ready for more. Wonder Woman looking good though. We're thrilled to announce that we'll soon be launching the Illudium Q36 explosive space modulator that'll destroy the Earth Hi, once and for all. Marvin, stop hacking the teleprompter. <laughs> This is a small glimpse of what we have in store for multiverses. We'll be sharing a lot more details in the coming weeks. I cannot wait. I cannot wait for these consistent news Brothers updates. Games, Warner Brothers games, we cannot wait to play multiverses with you on May 28th. Until then, the end. Guys, I wasn't done. All right. So May 28th. That is the day that I need to ask off for work. Uh. <laughs> All right, so May 28th, we really didn't see anything super new. I mean, the, the upgraded engine is really good because Unreal 5 is a good engine. So that's that's pretty pretty good. Um, we saw like two new attacks. We saw one for Taz and one for Morty. Sorry, I'm, I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it, okay, I'm looking for it. I'm sorry. Oh, here we go, it's actually right. Here, here we go. Yeah, so Morty has this, like, cool kick attack. That's pretty sick. As someone that played a lot of Morty, I'm already thinking of ways I can use that. Then we got Taz. Let's go back to that concept art, because that's really the only, like, really new, new stuff we saw. And I want to look at it again. Oh, uh, here we go. Okay. All right. Townsville Hall. That's a pretty neat map. I like that. I'm not sure what Townsville is from, though. I'm gonna be real. That might be a Steven Universe thing. I've seen a decent amount of Looney Tunes stuff, but I haven't seen anything from Steven Universe. And then this looks like... I don't know. <laughs> I feel like the alert right there, that's a clue. I should know who it is. Kind of looks like Dee Dee from Dexter's Laboratory, but I don't remember Dexter's Laboratory looking like this. Oh, it could be Dee Dee, because there's also another thing right there. I could be completely wrong on that. 
But yeah, so new concept art, new engine, a lot of new netcode stuff, so the game should be more responsive, which sometimes is a problem. Especially if everyone was playing on Wi-Fi. Uh, and the Unreal Engine 5, it does look a little bit crisper, especially here in LeBron James, you know? But yeah, really not too much new information in this, but we do have a release date, which I think is what everybody was, uh, was looking for. So May 28th, so we still got two months like two two-thirds months so we still almost, we have almost three months to wait but that gives them a lot of time to do marketing and you know build up the hype and stuff uh so yeah multiverses is coming back pretty soon uh of course as we get more information as you know new stuff gets revealed and the hype gets built i will be covering all the news all the updates all of that stuff uh, so if you're into that, if you're excited for Multiverses, if you want more Multiverses content, don't forget to leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, and, uh, leave a comment down below, what do you think about the May 28th release date, and educate me a little bit, show me what this concept art is, like, what stages are these, like, what properties are, are these from, because I feel like I should know, and I don't, so let me know down in the comments below, uh, but yeah, subscribe for, for Multiverse, everything Multiverses, news, gameplay, updates, stuff like that, and do me a huge favor and go down to the description down below and check out uh, the link to my Discord server where I'm trying to get like game nights set up. And uh, I want to run my own tournaments at some point, but we need uh, we need people for that. So uh, if you want to join one of the coolest multiverses communities, go check that out. Uh, I'm Zulu Leaks, and I will see you in the next video.